Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Michael, a.k.a. Rickshaw, a.k.a. B-Pain. That stands for back. And you're nerding out with Rickshaw. <laughs> and you're also nerding out with my friend. Obi-Wan Kotobi. Von Doom. <laughs> <laughs> wow oh. was that on the spot or yeah, it was on the spot because i forgot to look at my name list <laughs> <laughs> well me and obi-wan katobi we're gonna we're, we're trying to change things up uh usually we would do a live show and then you would you would see the clips from that live show but we've decided that we're just gonna do reactions and then we're gonna do our own little news you know like we'll go over some new nerdy news or some metal news or whatever and then we're you're just gonna see those and then our live show is just gonna be more uh round table and like fun and you know we'll talk about random shit so it'll be a little looser a yeah. little looser yeah a little looser on the live show uh you know more room for like live chat participation and such but um also we have a sponsor right now so uh if you guys before we get going if you guys like sennheiser headphones i am not using them right now because of my uh the way that we work things uh on our remote podcasts and stuff but when we uh meet up and we do it together oh, we i do use it. these <laughs> i use these sweet sennheiser over the ear studio headphones and if you like Sennheiser, I'm gonna have a link in the uh... the description. A link in the description. <laughs> I think there's five different options for uh, headphones, and if you go there, the promo code is ten nerding out. So one zero capital N E R D I N G O O O U T <laughs> ten nerding out. So we're gonna put that on the screen. And yeah, so if you're if you're in the market for some Sennheiser headphones, consider using the code and you will help us out as well as my friend Redbeard at Sennheiser. So, but yeah, uh, today we're going to talk about Disney making a real lightsaber. So, wow, I think that, yeah, wow, I was wow, like, wow. wow, apparently they... It was last week, I think, at South by Southwest. They had a little uh, ditty, and they introduced their, their new <laughs> lightsaber oh. on stage. And so what do you think about this, Toby? I mean, look, I'm not a big Star Wars guy, uh, even though I am Obi-Wan Kenobi. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they've got some really cool lightsabers that they've already been producing, so... This has to be some kind of step up. I, I don't know anything about it yet, so uh, I don't know. I mean, what are the details? What are the price points? Have they? I guess they haven't released that much information. They're just teasing it, right? Yeah, and and it's the type of thing too, where like I know that you, if you're not a Star Wars person, you're still you've still been a kid before, right, of you course. know what I mean? It's so it's like it's a lightsaber. It's still cool <laughs> as shit. Yeah. Right? Yeah. yeah. I mean, like every person. You know, I'm pretty sure every person, like in general, knows what a lightsaber is and knows what Star Wars is. Right. So it's like all the haters and stuff could could be like, all right, I'm not a, I'm not a fan of lightsaber. But all of the even all the haters have at least stood in a spot with their friend across from them and been like, <laughs> and like acted like you're gonna chop their arm off or whatever so well i mean lightsabers are even in like super smash brothers i think they're uh i don't know what game they're from or what but you know there's still a lightsaber looking item in those games i mean yeah i mean you you know you know what it is they make fun of it in every cartoon and parody it parody it in uh so many movies and stuff so everyone knows what a lightsaber is yeah and it's and we can't help like whenever you're talking about science fiction and you're talking about dudes with swords, like it always ends up upgrading to a lightsaber. Right. You know yeah. what I mean? Like they might not be able to say lightsaber because I'm pretty sure <laughs> Lucasfilm and Disney like owns that term. Right. But, you know, for the most part, everybody knows what a laser sword is, you know. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right. But yeah. They do have a lot of cool ones already, you know, like depending on how much you want to pay, 
and they're super rad. But now, apparently, they've upgraded to where it does come out of the hilt, and it just pops up, you know? Mm. So that's super cool. Let's, uh, let's watch this video real quick. Okay, cool. Okay, well, after that, my son Alex, he calls me up from college, and he says, hey, Pop, uh, my friend said that you had a lightsaber. That thing wasn't real, was it? And by the way, he wasn't alone. I got a lot of emails and, and calls of people saying, I don't think that thing was real. You guys want to see it? I feel like he just, put, he put just asked, us. do you want to see my dick? And everyone was like, yeah. <laughs> it was Bobby's birthday yesterday. <laughs> want to see my lightsaber? It's, it's pretty blue. Are we ready? Yeah, let's see. Let's see it, big boy. Yeah. All right, see, that was pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. Pretty cool, right? Yeah. Hey. It is real. Now, this one belongs to Ray. She let me borrow it, but we're going to have to get it back to her, so I'm going to get this back to, to Ray. Bobby, happy birthday. Thank you so much. Ray Charles? <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, I mean, you know, that's all, that's pretty much all we really need to see, you know, right, and that's, yeah. it's super rad, honestly. Yeah. So. Yeah. Uh, now, you know, like back in the day, you had the cheap ones that you could fling out and stuff, uh, and they yeah. like retracted through, I wonder how this one works, because it didn't appear to have like those little, you know, uh, I don't, help me out here. What are the retractable things called? You know how it just sit, uh, <laughs> it's just big enough to where it doesn't pull out the next one? You couldn't really right. see any of those, and I don't know. Yeah, I don't know, uh, because when you're saying real, though, like, my understanding of calling a lightsaber real is, like, you could chop meat with it. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> chop and cook so, at the same time? <laughs> it, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You could, like, cauterize the wound or whatever. Right, but yeah. But I think they're saying real, like as in it, you know, it actually pops out, you know, without without you having to do anything or whatever. But isn't that a little too slow for uh, for the lightsabers in the movies? Like, don't they like <laughs> real quick? I think. I mean, I think that they have more than one speed according to dramatic, uh, you know, effect. Oh, so when like, it calls for it, <laughs> right? Yeah, gotcha, exactly. Gotcha. Like. You know, there's times where it's like, you know, if 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 someone is like being held captive or whatever, and then they just draw their lightsaber with their force power and pop it out, it's super quick. Right. But if they want to be times, intimidating, they right. <laughs> but if they're like, "Hey, are we about to battle?" Then it goes slow. <laughs> I hope there's a setting on there, like a, a a drama setting, a dramatic setting that you can. <laughs> Yeah, this right. is intense. Let's do, maybe we should, let's watch it one more time. Let's just. I think it, it. I think it's on the dramatic setting when this guy is using it. We ready? Oh, that was a, that was a lot quicker than I thought. Okay, that was okay. That was not. I, I was thinking it was much slower when it did it, but that's okay. That's fair. Yeah. I don't know, man. That it's crazy. I guess. I guess we're gonna have to we're gonna have to talk about this whenever they release you know like how it actually works and stuff how, so. what the prize point is what colors can you get are the hilts gonna be different because i know don't different characters have different hilts and stuff yeah um definitely because you know they build them yeah yeah isn't <laughs> you know. and is the purple one gonna be more expensive well, of course it is motherfucker <laughs> <laughs> see i know a little bit about star wars come on Right, and you know, to be honest, I I've kind of fallen off the Star Wars train, but I watched episode of The Mandalorian earlier, and it was tight. Was it? Like I, yeah, I. It's like I know that I have friends that shit on that show, and I am like sometimes I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'm getting you know Star Wars, yeah, whatever. But I'll seriously watch it and be like holy shit that was tight like like i did every episode of season three the new season there is something that happens to where i'm like holy shit that was tight yeah so toby you know it's the type of thing where if if you were to get into star wars hey mandalorian 45 to like 45 to 50 minute episodes and it's like completely kind of like side story to all of the you know 
See, and I've the, been told, the, I've been told that if even though I'm not a Star Wars guy, that I would probably enjoy that. So maybe one day we'll see. I'll let I'll let like four seasons get out. That way I can just binge through them all. I'll get back to you in season four. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but hey, what do you guys think about a lightsaber? You know, even if even if you're a Star Wars hater, uh, it's pretty sweet to have a lightsaber. I know that if uh, if somebody if Steve Jobs was like. If Steve Jobs' force ghost came and was like, hey, you want a free lightsaber? I know that you wouldn't turn it down, haters. Would ya? No, you wouldn't. Anyways, <laughs> leave it in the comments. See, tell us what you think. Tell us how you think it works, honestly. So, Also, if you have uh, suggestions on some things you want us to cover, hit us up at nerdingoutwithrickshaw at gmail.com. And we'll... See you later, Obi-Wan Katobi. <laughs> later, Rickshaw. And may the Force be with you. I'm going to make everyone mad. Later, nerds. <laughs> <laughs> later, nerds.